It may have been a long way from France to Penrith, but the echoes of Australia's greatest sporting triumph touched every athlete looking for a little extra inspiration. The Panthers needed to show the type of determination that made Cadell Evans a national hero if they were to have any hope of halting this impressive manly machine. The home side threw everything bar a bike chain at the Eagles in the opening quarter. However, Des Hasler's side refused to crack. The sponge-like Sea Eagles soaked it up and launched their own strike through their fiercely competitive captain, Jamie Lyon. The men in pink ruled that the centre wasn't hurled when he went to ground and was entitled to play on. The next call went against Manly though. After Daly Cherry Evans scrambled across, the lead-up play was sent upstairs for checking. And video referee Bernard Sutton found that the ball had been propelled forward when Kieran Foran stripped David Simmons on a kick return. 40 minutes of niggle and near misses ended with the Sea Eagles up by just 6-0. Penrith persisted with their pressure and they were finally rewarded with half an hour to go. Did he get it down before the line? Cummins was there. He's going to point to the spot. So it's seven tries from seven matches at Penrith for Coote this year. Travis Burns' bid to equalise against his former club was lamentable to say the least. Oh. <laughs> One of your best shoots, huh? Well, that's the best. With a slender two-point advantage, Manly were making hard work of finishing this assignment off, with teammates getting in each other's way and Joe Nullivau employing some unconventional ball skills. But with Brett Stewart sniffing around the fringes, the Maroon and Whites were able to land the decisive blow. Gets it back to Kieran Foran and Foran goes all the way to put the ball down. Manly score. Well, that's creation more so than adventure following their miraculous escape against Parramatta the previous weekend the Panthers couldn't be discounted especially with one of the stars of that memorable night Lachlan Coote putting the pedal down goes up the sideline again gets away from a second Bure it was now Pertel it's been a 45 meter run and now it's ended in the touch oh what a shame for a brilliant run by Coote and uh, Des Hasler blowing up big time. With 90 seconds left, Burns rolled the dice one last time. David Simmons is going to get a try. David Simmons gets a try for Penrith. The Panthers declined the conversion in an effort to squeeze in a final play or two. However, this time there was no Houdini act. And they went down by 12 points to 8, surrendering their top 8 spot in the process. David Rollins, Big Pond Sport.